Namashivai children today we will do class 7 civics chapter number 10 the struggles for equality in the previous class we come to know about the tawa matsa sangha today we will come to know about the indian constitution as a living document the foundation of all movements for justice and the inspiration for all the poetry and songs on equality is the recognition that all people are equal now as you know the indian constitution recognizes the equality of all persons movements and struggles for equality in india continuously refer to the indian constitution to make their point about equality and justice for all the fish workers in the tawa matsa sangha hope that the provisions of the constitution will become a reality through their participation in this movement by constantly referring to the constitution they use it as a living document now something that has real meaning in our lives in a democracy there are always communities and uh, individuals trying to expand the idea of democracy and push for a greater recognition of equality on exciting as well as new issues now the issues of equality are central to a democracy in we have tried to highlight issues that pose a challenge to this idea of equality in a democracy these as you have read include the privatization of health services in the country the increasing control that business houses exert on the media the low value given to women and their work and the low earnings made by small farmers who grow cotton these issues substantially affect poor and marginalized communities and therefore concern economic and social equality in the country this is the core of the struggle for equality in a democracy the dignity and self respect of each person and their community can only be realized if they have adequate resources to support and nurture their families and if they are not discriminated against now the indian constitution in the ultimate authority on the subject of equality it recognizes certain rights of citizen which ensure equality the movements and people struggles have been inspired by these rights federation or organization are formed by the weaker sections of the society in the hope that through their participation in the movements the constitution would take provisions for their cause to be implemented one such example that we have which has come out as a result of people's movement is the right of children to free and compulsory education act or the right to education act that is rte this act was passed by the parliament on 4th august 209 it provides for free and compulsory education for children between the age of 6 to 14 under article 21a of the constitution the equality is central to all democracies now that to make a democracy succeed in the end the dignity and respect of an individual should be taken into account injustice and discrimination of any kind should be prevented inequality cannot be credited 
completely unless and until consistent and sincere efforts are taken. Today I am ending here. Nama Shivaya.